Hello, Conagher, Marine, Valley and Walton. Well, the past few weeks have taken us all completely by surprise and our lives have been completely turned upside down. Everything we do and the way in which we do it have had to change, whether it's the way we're learning, the way we're socially distancing in the supermarket, communicating with friends and family, or even delivering an assembly as we are now. And I'm sure you've struggled to find anybody who hasn't found an element of challenge in what we're doing. I sure have. As head of the house, we just wanted you to know how proud we are of each and every one of you and how well you've risen to the challenge that you didn't ask for that has been thrown at you. We don't know what the future holds or how long schools will be closed for, but we can try to shape our days to be positive and rewarding. As the country works together to try and combat the virus and help the NHS, we wanted you to know that we as Heads of House are working together more than ever as a team. And we wanted to deliver a few key messages to you as all four houses as one community. I'm now going to pass you over to Mr Thomas. Great stuff. Mr Campbell, could you just lend me a pen, please? <laughs> that worked. That worked, yeah. Genius. Right. May not work. OK, but I just wanted to talk about well-being and I wanted to use a phrase that Miss Gibb introduced me to, Miss Gibb, um, which is the Corona Coaster, which is a way to describe the sort of emotional roller coaster that certainly every single person I've spoken to over the last few weeks seems to be on. Some days you wake up and life's great. You get to have a lie in, you get to do a few things you like at home, play FIFA. Other days you're just in a mood all day and you're not sure why. Some days you just feel like crying. Some days you do cry. All of these are absolutely fine. And the thing about the Corona Coaster is we're all on it and it is absolutely fine and it doesn't make you abnormal at all to feel up and down during this time. I think it's important to remember our priorities, which is your health, physical and mental and your those around you. OK, and the one message I really want to really want to sort of get across here is it's so important that you stay in touch with people, you stay in touch with your teachers and your family. So. One more key message is communicate with people, communicate with teachers. If you're struggling with the work, if you feel overwhelmed, send them an email, go, go downstairs, talk to mum, dad, brother, sister, gran, whatever it is, stay in touch with people. OK, I'm going to pass you on now to Mr. Campbell. Hi, everyone. Again, I hope you're keeping your spirits up in these really weird times. You should be getting used to work being set for you on Firefly. Um, each of your subject teachers is now setting you at least one piece of work per week to keep you up to date on what you would have been studying if you'd have been in lessons in school. It's important you don't get totally out of practice with learning. So just like physical fitness, if you don't train physically, your brain loses the ability to acquire and retain new knowledge just as easily if you don't keep working. Trust me, it gets worse with age. We understand you've got loads of demands on your time and there might be days when it's a struggle to do anything at all. Believe me, we're all having days like that, just as Mr Thomas has said. Um, but do try and keep yourself in the, in the habit of working on something each day, just to try and keep up with it as much as you can. Your teachers are only an email away and believe me, we all want to hear from you. Ask them questions, tell them what you're enjoying, give them the sort of feedback that you'd be giving if they were there in the classroom with you. There's loads and loads of information on work to do on the COVID-19 Work for Students page on Firefly. Also, there's some videos reminding you how to access, how to send in work, anything you might have forgotten. So three top tips. Give yourself a timetable. It doesn't have to be as detailed as a school table timetable. It doesn't have to be packed full for the whole day, but it gives you a sense of routine. So include subjects to study, but also include fun activities, include a bit of exercise. Do what you can. Don't panic if you don't finish everything. And if you're worried, we're here for you. You may not be in school, but you're still part of the school. We're only an email away. So stay safe, check your emails, check Firefly. We miss you all. See you soon. And now, Mr. Gregory. Thanks, Mr. Campbell. Um, hello, everybody. It's great to uh, be able to talk to you in this uh, format. Um, very weird format, but it's nice to be able to still be able to do what I love to do, and that's... Uh, chat to loads of people at once as much as possible. Um, I want to talk to you about something that you know I, is very close to my heart, uh, and that's House Championship. Um, it's really important that we, as a community, continue to be involved uh, in something that uh, is a bit different than what we normally do. So we, we're talking about well-being, we're talking about 
keeping ourselves safe. We're talking about work, but actually the house competition will continue. Uh, and Mr. Thea has done a lot of work on the virtual house championship. Um, hopefully you will continue, continuing to see um, the new house competitions being launched by him. Uh, you'll also see the PE competitions as well. Uh, and it's just really important to get involved. Uh, and so put in your timetable over the week, even if it's a, an hour, one afternoon uh, over the week, that you're just going to take part in one of the house competitions. Um, the, the, the way we want it to be is participation. We, we as four of us are always competitive, but we're friendly competitive. And actually, the biggest thing we want from all of you at the moment is to participate and for us to know that you are still part of our school community on a day-to-day -day basis. So please do get involved. It's great to see all the uh, different um, uh, entries that you put in. So it'd be great if you could keep sending them, us to, them to us as well. But please keep involved. Uh, please keep your uh, momentum going and your, your motivation for it. Um, because when we do go back, you know full well that all four of us will speak to you uh, as our own houses with our new visions to push you on to win the house championship. Um, so uh, that's my bit. Um, uh, and I'm going to pass you back now just to Miss Gibb to finish off. Um, but um, thank you very much. So before we go, we just wanted you to know that we are genuinely missing each and every one of you, just seeing you around at school. This is uh, a typical meeting for us, the heads of house. We do this quite a lot and we do talk about you all a lot and how much we can't wait to see you all again. So from me, on behalf of all of us, be kind, be brilliant. Most importantly, stay safe and we hope to see you all soon. Take care. Bye. 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 Have we stopped?